jump, never had a brain for trees. Slush puppy kids swap brain for freeze. ES the game changer, I change degrees. Cause a blizzard anywhere I take my feet. Hey guys, it's Gaming HD here and welcome to stage 12 of La Vuelta and stage 12 is a little bit of a hilly one and I'm thinking it might be a breakaway day to, to be honest and I'm going to try and get Michael Matthews into the break. I don't think, uh, yeah, I'm, I also think that's the plan. So Michael Matthews, breakaway win, that's what I'm going for and obviously protect the GC because now Tom de moulin has got quite a good lead. We need to make sure he keeps it so uh, let's uh, 3D race it. Okay, so we need to make sure everyone's towards the front. Where's Michael Matthews? Alright, Michael Matthews is here. I need to really push on with him now to make sure I get right to the front. Alright, so let's keep moving, keep moving. Why are you so slow? Come on, Michael Matthews. Alright, looks like some people are getting ready to go. Yep, there they go. And I'm just going to follow their attack and try not use up any energy. And obviously now... There's absolutely no point in me chasing it down because I got Michael Matthews in the break and he's got a, an amazing chance of winning. So, uh, yeah, I'm well happy with that. Okay, so Michael Matthews is securely in the breakaway now. I'm going to move everyone up to the front, which they pretty much are. And let's work on protection. So, uh, Wilkie Kelderman, he's still looking pretty good. I'm going to get uh, one bar grill. It's going to protect Tom de Moulin through this stage. And Lawrence and Dam's still looking really good, so I'll get him to sort out Welker Kelderman. Awesome. And everyone else, they can just literally chill, because uh, there's no need to do anything, really. Okay, so I checked the breakaway, and uh, there's no one really that important in there, so uh, yeah, it's looking really good for us. Uh, I think I've got a really good chance of winning this stage with uh, Michael Mash, especially with the finish, a bit of descent, a little bit of a kick at the end. Absolutely perfect, so... Uh, Hopefully, this breakaway can get away. Coming really close to the sprint now, so I need to get right ready with uh, with Michael Matthews. Going, well, about, we've got one kilometre to go, so I'm going to start pacing off of him at like 95. I just need to go really hard just to make sure I get it. Anyone going to try and, no, all right. Sweet, so I won that, nice. Let's go back to pacing well with everyone else. Let's get some water as well. Let's get you to get me some water. Happy days. All going good. Okay, so it's still about only two minutes, so it doesn't look like this breakaway is going to actually get away, unfortunately. I'm going to make sure I keep an eye on it, but obviously this climb's coming up now, so I'm going to have to make sure that none of these guys lose any time as well. So who's near the front, like Viviani? Tom de Moulin's actually a little bit further back than I'd like him to be. R yeah, I don't like that. All right, let's make sure you're right near the front. And same with Wilker Kelderman, you need to get right near the front. Okay, they're going surprisingly hard up this climb. They're really trying to tear it up, which is not good for my uh, my Michael Matthews plan. Not at all. So, what shall I do? Shall I try and... I might wait now. Look, not even the whole group's not even working now. Only a couple people are, which is a bit of a pain. But, um, so what I might do is I might relax and wait for the uh, peloton to catch up again and maybe try and get in another breakaway or do i just concentrate on the gc everyone seems to be a little bit happy here bar grills up here Wilker kelderman's up here tom de moulin's obviously up here we're not doing too bad here we've got a good position we're, we're close to the close to the front so we shouldn't get caught out uh, but obviously Michael Matthews has literally got 45 seconds now. They're literally right behind us, and it's not going well. Maybe uh, these this group of three, maybe we can get away. We're doing pretty well at the moment. Okay, so the peloton seems to be letting us get away again slightly. We're up to a, a minute almost, but we're also in a world of hurt. How's everyone else doing? Tom de Moulin's still nice and close to the front of things, with Bar Grill protecting him. We're looking all right. Kelderman's still there. Where's Warren Bargo? Oh, Warren Bargo's still up there in the eye. Right. A few of my guys are a little bit further back than I'd want. Lawrence the Dam looked like we dropped him. Oh dear, that's not good. And he's down. All right. So it looks like it looks like it's gone a lot harder than I thought it would. But Michael Matthews is still up here, and even if he gets caught up, at least uh, my GC guys will have someone else to protect him. But we're gonna we're gonna keep on going. I really don't think uh, Michael Matthews is gonna get away in this breakaway it, I don't think it's gonna work so uh, I think I might just drop back now but then if I drop back it means 
No, I'm going to have to start pacing again with my team. No, I'm going to keep going, actually. We'll keep going. All right, we've just been caught up then. Michael Matthews' little attempt has gone the shit, basically. But at least uh, we've got another person to protect my GC guys now. So that's awesome. And I might. what I'm going to do is I'm just going to hang near the front with Michael Matthews because another attack might form in a minute on this next climb. And if I could get away with Michael... Oh, look, Michael Matthews is struggling now. This is going quite hard. we got, oh, Michael Nieve, like, putting on a hell of a pace down the front. Uh, where is everyone? Where's... Oh, Quintana's still marking the Mulan, basically. Ooh, or do I go for something a little bit cheeky? And uh, try and get Woku Kelderman to attack. But is that just going to make it hard for everyone else? What's he doing? He's in really good form. But Tom Dumoulin's stats are still absolutely fantastic. So, uh, all right, let's get Woker Kelderman right near the front. Actually, Michael Matthews is starting to recover a little bit. So I'm going to push on that 85 of him. And then I'm just going to attack. I'm attacking. We're doing it. We're going for it. Alright, it's going pretty well. They're letting me get away really well, so, uh, 40, 50, alright, alright, now I'm going to pace it, 85, nice, oh, hang on, some people are getting away at the back, let's, uh, watch this, who's it, alright, okay, okay, so this is, uh, interesting, this is interesting, but I've got my team here, do I... Do I carry on with my team? No, I shouldn't really. I don't want to chase down Michael Matthews. He's doing really well over this climb. I might turn him down to about 80. I might get him to get some water bottles while I'm here. My team's all together near the front. I just need to make sure no one really important gets away. These guys only really got about 12 minutes. But they're also pretty good. But they're nowhere near good enough to out-sprint Michael Matthews. As long as Michael Matthews can get over the top of this climb, he should be pretty sorted to be honest i'm going to turn him down to about 72 though all right he's doing quite well all right these guys here will need water bottles for some reason i don't really care about them though because they're just getting dropped so bad all right we need to keep an eye on this one as well because we can't let uh like quintana or anyone get away all right it looks like these two guys are catching michael matthews up it might be worthwhile i'm not going to turn down the pace too much but i might go like 68 just to make sure he definitely makes the top of the top of this climb obviously them two can work together Whereas Michael Matthews is now stuck on his own. But I've got a good time. I've got a good time between them and the main peloton. The main peloton's actually kind of regrouped a little bit. They're going quite easy and it looks like they're quite happy to let it go. Michael Matthews is going to make it over the top. Michael Matthews has made it over the top. They've only got about 20 some odd seconds now. I'm going to have to wait for them, I think. But I'm going to do the bare minimum now and just keep an eye on it. All right, so they're not actually working together now. Oh, they are. One person's working. Make sure I make it to the top of this. Nice, we've made it to the top of that pretty well. We've got about two minutes on the peloton. Hang on, let's just make sure everyone's doing okay. Yep, everyone's all right. Back to Michael Matthews. And who's that? Tony Martin. Oh, God. Oh, all right. So, all right, I'm going to have to... Oh, wow. All right, okay. Michael Matthews. Don't mess this up. We've got four kilometers to go. Let's keep an eye on everything. Let's not do too much work. I might, oh, I don't know. I'm not really sure how to pace this. I don't know. They're starting to play games a little bit. But we've got about two minutes, so we can kind of play a few games. All right. I'm going to maintain position. I'm not going to do any work for a little bit. Oh, no, they didn't like that. Right, I'm following. Oh, God, I didn't realise how fast the time's gone. Oh, my God, I should be sprinting. Oh, my God. Sprint, 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 sprint. Michael Matthews, sprint, 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 sprint. Keep sprinting. Keep sprinting. Oh my god, it's going to be so close. I almost messed up really bad then. Whew. That was close. Oh, hang on a second. Where's everyone else? I almost completely forgot about the other race going on. Oh, Quintana's like right at the front. Oh my god, this is a little bit dangerous now. All right. Tom de Moulin, you're going to have to go flat out. Go flat out. Please, no gaps. Please, no gaps. We do not want any gaps right now. It looks like Tom de Moulin's going to be safe. But I kind of... Lost concentration there, like, on both ends. The time just flies by so fast. But we got a win, which is amazing. 
And we're having a fantastic Vuelta. Absolutely amazing. Whoa, there we go. Fantastic. Okay, so Michael Matthews won the stage, which is amazing. And it looks like there was no time no time loss. So, yeah, there we go. Tom de Moulin still got about a minute and a half. So, another great stage. And I'm really happy still. So, uh, yeah, not too bad. As always, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. And I'll see you next time. Peace out. Thanks for watching the video. If you enjoyed it, hit the subscribe button. If you want to keep notified, hit the little bell next to the subscribe button. And uh, like, comment, and give it a share. It really helps out. Cheers.